Hey sweeties, welcome back to my channel. My name is Mrs. Ashley and I do fashion hauls and self-care or self-love videos here on my channel. If you like that kind of thing, then definitely go ahead and subscribe to my channel. It is totally free and hit that bell notification to be notified of all my future videos. And today we are going to be going into my summer essentials or summer stuff that I love right now. So if you like that or if you are interested in what type of spring summery stuff that I'm into, then just keep on watching. So today we are going to be going into some summer items. So as you guys know, I have bought this backpack from a haul that I did from Reb Dolls. If you want to check out that video, I'll have it linked up at the iCard right there. Um, but yeah, I really love this backpack. A backpack is a good way to take a lot of stuff like snacks and um, your essentials, water bottles, anything that you may need. It is crucial, crucial, crucial when you're like, um, when it will be time to go back into events and you know we all do or go picnicking or anything like that that we keep snacks and um, water and juices or whatever the case may be that you love it is good to bring of course a backpack so this is my backpack and of course there's a lot of backpacks in style right now and this is just Next one of many is my california hat i am really really excited to be you know wearing this out and about um i have not worn it out yet but it just says born and raised and then the front has california on it and i got this at walmart it does have the um, adjustable, what is this called, tie for your head. So this is what mine looks like. And I was looking for a good cap that I could wear, you know, out or when I'm having a bad hair day. Like now I'm really having a bad hair day. Um, but... Yeah, I think it is super cute. Just super summery and super spring because it is a light color and I am super digging this. So yeah, definitely need a cap to keep you um, from those harsh Next rays. This is my favorite scent that I have been using a whole lot lately. I got this from my husband for from um, Christmas, which is the Daisy Dream Mark Jacobs fragrance and I love this this smells very very much so like sophisticated and also um a little bit florally and that just reminds me of springtime so I definitely picked this one up um or I'm using this currently and I super love it I even got I mean, it came with the gift set, so I even have the body lotion for this, and I absolutely love this. So if this is um, your type of scent, I would highly suggest picking up like a rollerball or, you know, um, the actual scent itself. So this is one of my favorites right so now. So this, as you guys know, is the Michael Kors MK, I think it's a Ke MK Go. Uh, Michael Kors Go Watch. I got this again from Christmas time and I am using it a whole lot. Um, I probably could use it a whole lot more. I just sync this up with my um, Google, my Google Fit and however many steps I do, it records it and also I can look at messages or incoming um like text messages through my watch before having to look at it on my phone. So this is a really good go to go item that I use a whole lot. And plus it's a really cute watch. You can change the, um, the different screens on here. So mine right now is set to this one right here. And it also brings up a lot of, um, notifications. So 
I have this screen right here, which is super cute. I highly, highly suggest one of these. I don't have a Fitbit, so this is the a really good um, watch for keeping your steps in check. As I mean, I believe it is for both. Um, I'll definitely have it in the description box if you are able to use it with Android because that's what I have. I have the Samsung Galaxy S10. Um, my husband has the Apple and so I just bought him his. So we're going to see if I'm going to put down in the description box if it is compatible with Apple as well. So I highly suggest a you know step counter especially staying indoors it's really been rough for me um staying home so i am going to make time to go ahead and do my steps a lot more and get outside um and do my you know morning runs again and everything like that and if you do have a google fit I think Google Fit or something like that. I'll have my username down in the description if you want to go and follow me there and challenge me to some steps. I would not mind um, a little bit of challenge. Next, we are going into highlights. So I am a big highlight fan. Bretman Rock, um, Wet n Wild's Bretman Rock highlight. Jungle Rock was my favorite spring um, launch this year so I super love this formula I love the consistency I love the look of it I'm wearing that today and I just absolutely adore this highlight um, there's nothing really like it I use it a whole lot um, but yeah so highlight is good and this is a good to go into foundation so a lot of the time spring and summer is all about the dewy finish and just getting that glow on um, if you're drier obviously you're gonna be more um, better off with these type of foundations however I am a oily t-zone girl and I get dry patches everywhere else sometimes sometimes I get dry patches in between here which is really crazy but everywhere else I am oily and I happen to love the photo focus dewy, um, yeah, just dewy photo focus foundation from Wet n Wild. I got the color um, golden beige, but I could go darker since I am getting a little bit darker um, now that the sun is out. I shall get another color because in my stick foundation, I believe I got a darker color and I just mixed the two right now. So the, right now this is working for me for the middle of my face and then I use a darker foundation on the outer side of my face. But it is a good, you know, foundation for dewy, um, that dewy look. And if you don't want um, to deal with like, it's not very like, it doesn't slip and slide off my face or anything like that as long as I use a, um, a pore blur or a mattifying um, primer I use it together so that it gives me my matteness but it also gives me that dewy fresh face look and I just love that so if you are interested in that um, check out your local Walgreens because that's where I got mine and I'm super into it now this item I picked up a while ago and this is the glass liquid skin now again we are going into that dewy skin finish I would not recommend if you are a oily girl like me um, to use the glass liquid skin on the dewy foundation um, I actually do the opposite so I use the glass liquid skin with the um, with some of my mattifying like um, tart shape tape or anything that's going to give you that like mattifying look in a foundation but adding this gives that luminosity like that glow from within so I super love that for that um, I super love this for that and I'm just super in love with this product um, illuminating skin primer which I didn't think I was going to be loving since I am an 
oily girl on the t-zone um but i have not had any problems with this product so far especially if i pair it with the right foundation so if you are oily girl like me definitely do opposites from you know what i mean like so if you're doing the dewy foundation do a mattifying primer if you're doing the illuminating primer um do a mattifying foundation um if you happen to get oily in the next you guys know i am still in love with my stay super sweet lip balm that you can find i'll have it in the description box down below on my website at messeshorty.com it I have watermelon, pina colada, and pomegranate, and I love every single flavor. Um, I'm still in stock of that, and um, if you want to purchase, you know, these, uh, I think it's a two-pack, and it shows which flavors you want, which flavor combination you want, um, definitely hit that, hit my site up, you know, just, you know, hit it up, because, um... I worked really really hard on it and if you like you know you're you're got chap lips and you want some supple lips and it's handmade in the USA um, just check it out and see if you like it. is my Anastasia this one is the trial run but it's like a tinted lip gloss and this one is in yeah, it's a lip gloss and this is in the color toffee. So this is what I'm wearing today. It is definitely my go-to like everyday lip gloss and I just put it on and I'm out the door. Um, it, I just love it. It's just a good nude lip and I don't have to work really hard to get that look. I just put it on and just like head out the door. I could put this in a small purse and... Um, yeah, it's super travel friendly. I may be purchasing the regular size of it because I love it so much because it's super so, versatile. Those are my favorite spring summer essentials for 2020. If you have any other products that you want to share down in this uh, down in the comments down below, please do. I would love to see and hear um, what kind of products you are into right now and yeah so i hope you like this video definitely give me a thumbs up if you did um and don't forget to hit that subscribe button once again because um, my giveaway has ended and i will be picking my winner however i will be having another giveaway when i hit my 1k here on youtube and i love you guys so much i hope you guys are doing well being well staying safe out there and yeah, I'll have an update video on why I've been gone for a week um, just so that you guys know why I have been gone and what's going on in my life. And I just hope and pray that everything goes well. So I hope you guys are staying well and being well. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Like always, stay super sweet.